Good morning, Colonel Bly. It's Friday, October 9th. I'm Aaron. And I'm Malcolm. And, and here, here are your morning, morning announcements. announcements. Just a reminder that even at home, you can watch Cougar Vision. Just go to the Colonel Bly website or go to the Cougar Vision YouTube channel. For students interested in joining the C Flats, Colonel Bly's international award-winning vocal jazz group, there will be an interest meeting on Wednesday, October 14th at 3.15 through Google Meet. If you would like to attend the meeting, send an email to Mr. Crossett, and he will reply with a link to the meeting. Are you interested in pursuing post-secondary education in the STEM fields? The SET Foundation is hosting a virtual university panel this Saturday, October 10th, featuring undergraduates and graduate industry professionals from fields such as computer science, engineering science, software engineering, and schools such as University of Waterloo, University of Toronto, and more. This event is a great opportunity to educate yourself and prepare for applications and gather insight into potential future pathways. By attending, your name gets entered into a draw for one of four $25 Amazon gift cards. To register and for more information, please visit setfoundation.ca. This week, Cougar Vision is airing the speeches for student council elections immediately followed by online voting. Today is for the final position. co -prez. let's take a look at our nominees. Let's go. Hey CB, it's Alex Chomsky, and I'm running to be your co -prez. You might be thinking, Hey, I've seen this guy before. And that's because you probably have. Whether it's representing our school on sports teams, organizing a club and prom, helping out younger cougars through tutoring. Math and calculator, you can actually do this if you want. Do you know how to graph a function, Brian? Yes. Showing school spirit on student council. Or just walking around the neighborhood. I'm everywhere at CB, so why not vote for a little more? Alex Chomsky for Copres. A little more Alex. Hi, I'm running for Copres, and um... I'm Annie Nguyen, and I'm here to say you should vote for me on election day. Election week, election night, electing Annie is right. I'll be the Jim Halpert across from your dike. N G U I N. I promise I am no normal new yen. I can't do math and I can't play piano, but when it matters most, I can show leadership, fellowship, partnership, trumanship, citizenship, battleship. I'll do my job and I won't slip. <sighs> I know that sounds cheesy, but I really love CB. I'll make a great co prez so go vote. Annie. I'm back. Hey, CB. For those of you that don't know me, I'm Neil, and I'm running to be your co prez I know it's a little weird not holding speeches in the gym as usual, but don't worry. If you liked Neil before, you'll love Neil live on Cooter Vision. So why should you vote Neil for Cobras? Simply put, I'm the most experienced Studco member left at Colonel Bay, having been on student council the past two years. I've come a long way from not knowing how to use a mic properly when I was elected grade 10 rep to the legendary Field and Neil campaign when I was elected treasurer last year. I've put everything on the line for student council. I put my dignity on the line on Wacky Wednesday when I went out in public to buy pies to save our Spirit Week activity, looking like a darn Oompa Loompa. I even put my body on the line when I was constantly shoved against the wall by Tip and Nam just for the Christmas kit. I've committed everything to this group I love. It might be an unusual year for Studco, so vote for someone you know has experience at student council and knows how it works to make the transition a little easier. Field Neil, let's do this one last time. Oh, hey Cougars, I didn't see you guys there. My name's Griffin Campbell, and I'm running to be one of your co prez this year. What's this you may be asking? Oh, just my to-do list, you know. Find a cure to COVID, end world hunger, solve world peace, the usual. All joking aside, while I may not be able to do all of this in one year here, Colonel Bayat, one thing I can do is try and make this year as fun and exciting as possible given the circumstances. For those of you who don't know me, my name's Griffin. I'm one half of this year's sports desk. I'm an IB dropout. And during my three years here at Colonel Bayat, I've been on a number of clubs and sports teams. So I like to think I have a pretty good idea of what makes Colonel Bayat so special. I can't wait to hear what all of you have to say about how we can make this year even more amazing. And as your co prez I promise to have as much hybrid fun as possible. So remember, vote Griffin for co prez What's up, Cougars? My name is Alexia Pantiris, and I'm running to be your co prez Now, I'm up for a big challenge today because not only am I running against all of these amazing people, but I only have 45 seconds to talk, and I talk a lot, so this is going to be quite difficult for me. But I'm going to jump right into it. Since day one at Colonel Bay, I've loved taking part of as many school events as I possibly can, like the musical or coffee houses or being part of student council. And I've always thought to myself how lucky I am to be a cougar. 
Now, I can't promise you that this year will go back to the way things used to be, but I can promise that I'll try to do everything in my power to have you leaving here next year thinking, wow, I love my year regardless of the circumstances. Thanks for listening, Colonel Bai, and remember to vote for me as your co-pres. I'm Alexia Pantier, signing off. Hello, CB. My name is Ian Johnston. I am a grade 12 student, and I'm running to be your co-pres. But more precisely, to be the tallest co-pres in CB history. Now you may ask, why would I be a good co-pres? Firstly, I am 6 foot 8, which means I can see above and beyond the competition. Secondly, I am very creative, and since this is my last year at CB, I want to make it as fun and unique as possible for you. Thirdly, I'm all ears, and I want to hear what each and every one of you have to say. And lastly, I am compassionate, and if elected, I'll be the best co-pres possible. So vote me, Ian Johnston, and make history of having the tallest co-pres ever at CB. And that's all the time I got, so I'll see you guys at school. Bye bye Wow, those speeches were stupendous! Go to the Colonel Bike website to cast your vote, CB. Free the Children is hosting its interest meeting Tuesday, October 13th at 3.30. Sign up to the Free the Children mailing list via the sign-up link in the club directory to receive the Google Meet link. We hope to see you there! Hey, Malcolm, what would you do with $1,000? I don't really know, but I could use some extra V-Bucks. Well, that's a waste. But if you want a chance at winning an annual OSSTF Student Achievement Award, you need to create an original piece of writing, art, or media. On this year's theme, kindness is a renewable resource. The submission deadline is November 4th. Your application package will go through a school, district, regional, and provincial competition. For more information, check out the website at ostf.on.ca. Search Student Achievement Awards or talk to Mr. Park. College and university visits have gone virtual due to COVID-19. They'll not be able to visit the school in person. Students can access the College University Virtual Info Sessions Google Doc, which contains links to all the information you need on the CB website under Guidance. Hey CB, it's your final chance to donate to the Glosser Emergency Food Cupboard. Make sure to donate at School Cash Online, since they're currently not accepting any non-perishable items. Even the smallest of donations goes a long way in helping those who rely on it. Please consider donating. Well, that's all from us today, CB. Have, Have a, a food, food drive Friday. Friday.